Ladies and gentlemen, it's your guy, Mr. 945, and yes, indeed, you know what time it is. All right, back with another video. Um, I'm going to do a little something different. Well, I don't know how different it is. There's other stuff out there, but I wanted to do a comparison video of a few different handguns. Um, I'm going to start off with some old school handguns, and we have here... The Smith & Wesson 5904. This is a, dub, a double action, single action, 9mm. Hammer fired with the steel slide aluminum frame. This is a very, very good gun. I believe these were produced back in the late 80s and they got discontinued in like the late mid to late 90s. This is a very, very, very good gun. Um, I picked this one up used and... A very good shooter I did upgrade the grips on here and just to show you guys we are clear actually just came back from the rain shooting these two um, so I'll give you a sense of the trigger this is the single action pull you got some take up back to the wall break look at that reset there you go. Not much in terms of the reset. Good and audible. This is good. This is a four inch barrel. Again, double action, single action, hammer fired um, with the aluminum frame steel slide. Now, in comparison, another old school candidate that is also a very good shooter and a very popular one. We're going to show clear on this one too. This is the Beretta 92 FS. As you can see, both of these guns have a safety on them. And I'll give you a sense of the trigger pull here. So there's the take up, break, right there. All right, so with that said, two very good shooters. The thing about this one though, this is also a double action, single action, hammer fire, steel slide. I think this is an aluminum frame. This is a 4.9 inch barrel. And there's a different type of design on. This is the open cut or open top design, as you can see. So it's not the normal tilting barrel design that you normally see. Um, and this, they both have decockers with the safety as well. Um, so again, from a versus standpoint, which one shoots better? Which one is better? This one had military contract. This one was really heavy with the police. Um, police usage across, you know, normal police force, um, FBI, sort of back in the day, right? So which one actually shoots better? You can't go wrong with either one of these. Um, Price-wise, these are discontinued. You can find them on the used market. These you can still find roughly. These are roughly around 600 or so. Use you can find these probably between four and six hundred depending on the condition. <clears throat> but which one shoots the best? And I just came from the range and I shot both and I compared them side by side. And it's really hard. I mean, it's really hard to, to call it on one. So um, if I had to pick, though, mm, let's see. This one has actually a little bit more weight to it, though. This has more weight. So on Beretta's website, it did say that this is an aluminum frame. Um, so I'm not sure if it's steel, but this one has more weight to it. I don't know if it's just more mass with that extra 0.9 inches. In terms of that, it could be. Mm, if I had to call it, I would probably give it to... In terms of, for me, this is in my opinion, based on my shooting skills, I would give it to the Smith & Wesson. For me, I actually shot better with the Smith & Wesson. So, go figure. But, again, from a versus standpoint, oh, in terms of capacity, they both, uh, this one is a 15-round mag. Um, you can get them 10 rounds for compliance states. Uh, this is actually a 18-round mag. Um, you can get these in 15 rounds, um, you can get them in 17, 18 rounds, 10 rounds as well, um, Metgar M9 Mag. So definitely more abundance of options for the Beretta. 
But in terms of, again, shootability, I would probably lean more towards the Smith & Wesson. You have more aftermarket support for this one. But again, track record for me, I would probably go with this one. So what do you guys think in terms of comparison? Which one do you think versus Smith & Wesson 5904, Beretta 92FS? What's your pick? Mr. 945, I'm out.